as I was working today, I decided why not share you guys how I make one of my custom stamps. So I'm going ahead and I went in, I printed out my design and I had to mirror that image and I'm just covering it with permanent marker. Went in and I filled that up and I used permanent marker and pen for that process and now I'm going in with the stamp scraper thingy my bob and I'm going in with every edge as delicately as possible because I cannot mess this part up and I'm going to cover go around the whole border of the design first before I tackle every other edge that I have for this stamp but doing the letter parts is the most tedious part and then of course just digging out the rest of the rubber to actually create the stamp. It's actually kind of satisfying. It took me a while, but it didn't take me that, that long. And it wasn't that really hard to do. I think anybody can do it. And this is definitely eco-friendly choice to do when you are trying to brand your business. You can use this stamp and create apparel with this stamp. You can use this to brand boxes, to brand poly mailers, to brand... Um, I like to use this for branding my bags to make custom bags instead of buying custom bags or having them made some kind of other crazy way. And this is the stamp that I have. I cut off the excess um, space to actually create kind of a handle so that it's easier for me to actually utilize it as a stamp. But I'll show you guys how <laughs> I use more eco-friendly ways to actually utilize the rubber stamps that I make after this process is done. Thank you for watching. Follow for more content.